A new kind of solar panel could soon be on your roof. Noah Chast joins us now. Noah, what's different about this one? Yeah, well, Lee, a couple things. First of all, it's designed by Tesla, the electric car company, among other things. And secondly, it's designed to look like a normal roof. The cost is certainly not the same as a normal roof, but one homeowner in Bend tells me it's worth it. Yeah, I mean, I think the beauty of the product is that you can't tell it's solar. Jake Hermling is the first Central Oregon homeowner to have a Tesla solar roof built on a house. The roof has solar tiles meant to look like shingles instead of the typical panels. Most people come by, they have no idea. The roof was installed by Green Lee Roofing, a Bend-based company who received clearance from Tesla last January. A few other companies have clearance throughout the state, but Director of Sales Hobie Smith says, We're the first and only in Central Oregon. Smith says a roof like Hermeling's would cost roughly eighteen dollars to $20,000 for normal architectural shingles. The solar roof is close to twenty-five dollars to $30,000 more. Hermeling says having a net positive house with the opportunity for a tax rebate is worth the upfront cost. As I was factoring it into my build cost, it was kind of a, you know, not, it was not a difficult decision to make on the financial side. Everything that he would be spending per month, whether it be $150, $200 per month, he's gaining back. However, not every tile on the roof is solar. Most of the roof you're seeing that collects energy from the sun is the actual tile, but the areas that are in the shade, like this little corner right here, is dummy tile. Smith says the dummy tiles have the same glass structure, but without the solar technology, to avoid wasting money and resources in areas that wouldn't produce enough energy. Tesla has an app that yeah. shows what the roof is producing in real time. Okay. And then it shows what the house is consuming and then how much is going to the grid. Hermeling says it's the amount of sun his house does get that makes him confident he's in the right place to go solar. Yeah, I mean, I think one of the unique things that Central Oregon has in regards to solar in the state of Oregon in general is 300 days of sun, right? Like, <laughs> that's usually the biggest factor you need with solar panels. And Smith tells me since January, interest in the Tesla solar roof has increased. He believes as solar becomes more popular, the initial cost will start to go down. Lee?